The idea was to develop a well-designed building where the architecture expresses the idea of the building to be a plus energy building, not to apply some uh, special things to be a, a, a passive uh, or low energy building, but the idea was to make a design, an architectural concept for a, a plus energy building, to integrate the photovoltaics, to integrate all the daylighting uh, aspects and strategies, and to integrate uh, solar gains, for example. First hand, there's uh, the re reduction of the energy demand. To make a very good insulated building with very good U-values, very good thermal insulation, uh, very good windows to reduce the heat losses. And on the other hand, there's the energy production, which is done by re regenerative uh, uh, things. So, for example, we use wood pellets to produce the heat and we use the photovoltaics to produce electricity. On one side, we use the natural ventilation by opening the windows, which is done by motors. So the, window, when the windows are opened during the breaks uh, by a motor driven, uh, uh, yeah, by motor. And uh, on the other hand, we use a mechanical ventilation, uh, which runs all the time with a very low uh, uh, air volume uh, so we have fresh air all the time and we have a lot, a big amount of air during uh, the opening of the windows in the breaks. The energy con consumption is, is very low. The primary consumption is, uh, primary energy consumption is 23 kilowatt hours per square meter in a year, which is, which is very, very low. And uh, the production, the energy production uh, is 24 kilowatt hours per square meter. It's just one kilowatt hour more than uh, the demand is, but this is enough to be plus. We learn that it's not very easy to, to establish sophisticated strategies in the building because the, the workers on site often don't have uh, uh, the experience in uses, using uh, more sophisticated things. This is maybe one experience and I hope we get more experiences when the monitoring of the project and the evalu evaluation has been done in the next years.